Hello everybody, Meat here. So I was looking over the new patch announcements and I got to thinking about something. While I'm not going to get into any of the details of the new content that'll probably be for another video, I wanted to make a suggestion of what I think could make WoW more fun. I know, fun's not really a word that Blizzard uses very often. Not like uh, squander as much money out of our customers as we can. But enough talk, let's get right into it. Now you don't have to be currently playing, but if you're in the WoW community, then you know about Time Rips. These are these cool little events that start at the top of every hour where you defeat some enemies, fill the bar, and then fight the boss. Pretty simple. So far there are five Time Rift bosses to my knowledge. King Mechagon, Merkadan, King Varian, Nazoth, and the OG Lich King. Now the main ones I wanted to focus on for this video are the Glorious Alliance and the Lich King. The Lich King one is based in reality where the Scourge are overrun. They're like everywhere. And the Glorious Alliance reality is where the faction war never ended and Varian is still alive. I'm going to be honest, I'm not the biggest fan of the Dragonflight dungeons. There's really only like two that I enjoy doing and I absolutely despise Black Hollow Den. The latest raid was okay too, I guess. I mean 90% of the raid is good but you made Nefarian the second to last boss in his own raid. And then the last boss, you know, the big boss of the raid, good loot, is some generic Drakthir. I mean, I literally recreated the boss in character creation. It only took seven minutes. Anyways, I'm getting off track here. So here's what I propose. Time Rift Dungeons. The concept is really simple. Make a new dungeon for each time rift. Five time rifts, five dungeons. I already have a vision for the first two, so here we go. The first is the Glorious Alliance dungeon. Now, just imagine. You enter the dungeon just outside of the gates of Stormwind, and you have to fight your way through the guard until you get to the trade district. This is where you'll face the first boss. After that, fight through more mobs, making your way through Old Town, and you face the second boss here. I'm thinking it can be one of these PvP vendors, preferably this dude. Or you can pick the four best vendors and face them as mini bosses before getting to the actual boss. Next, you fight your way through to the keep, face Old Man Varian himself, the third and final boss. Now, we don't actually have to defeat the real McCoy here. He can be an infinite dragon of the Dragonflight dude, disguised as Varian, which is nothing new for them. Boom! End of dungeon. Now a dungeon for the Horde. So you know the big AB the Alliance has, right? Yeah, well the infinite dragonflight is at it again. This time they're trying to steal it so they can bring it to our reality and drop it on Orgrimmar for their sins of recruiting the Valpera. Probably for the best. Anyways, you talk to Garrosh and he sends you out to Razor Hill. Fight off the Alliance, get to Terragard, and stop the infinite dragon dudes. First boss just outside the gates of Orgrimmar, the second in Razor Hill, and the final boss in Terragard. I know they're simple dungeons, but I feel the game needs a little simplicity right now. So I just realized that the, the last two were actually for the same time rift. So uh, five time rift, six dungeons. Okay, so this one is by far my favorite because I don't have a solid path laid out for it because I can imagine just so many possibilities with this one. Based in the Lich King reality, pretty simple formula. Start the dungeon, defeat three bosses, and go home. The problem is, I don't know where the dungeon should be located. I would love to see the Scourge overrun Thousand Needles, but none of this jumping from rock to rock. No, the water is frozen over, and the whole dungeon is fought on ice. Or maybe holding the last line of defense in Nordrasil. Or, now hear me out here, a reality where we defend Silvermoon City. The whole dungeon, all three bosses are here in the Dead Scar. But, it's not the Dead Scar. It's not destroyed yet. Personally, that's my favorite scenario. Well, that's it. That's my idea. And if nothing else, maybe we can just have Twitch streamers for bosses.
Oi! What are you doing? You don't even play well anymore. Same chart. Same chart. Did anyone get the out? If you don't have the moose by now, go into the bathroom, look in the mirror, look at yourself and say, I fuck.